Belgian chocolate French, chocolat Belgique, Dutch, Belgish chocolade is chocolate produced in Belgium. A major industry since the 19th century, today it forms an important part of the nation's economy and culture. The raw materials used in chocolate production do not originate in Belgium, most cocoa is produced in Africa, Central America, and South America. Nonetheless, the country has an association with the product that dates to the early 17th century. The industry expanded massively in the 19th century, gaining an international reputation and, together with the Swiss, became one of the commodities most important producers in Europe. Although the industry has been regulated by law since 1894, there is no universal standard for the chocolate to be labeled Belgian. The most commonly accepted standard dictates that the actual production of the chocolate must take place inside Belgium. Topic: History. Belgium's association with chocolate goes back as far as 1635 when the country was under Spanish occupation shortly after chocolate had been brought to Europe from Mesoamerica. By the mid-18th century, chocolate had become extremely popular in upper and middle class circles, particularly in the form of hot chocolate. Among them was Charles Alexander of Lorraine, the Austrian governor of the territory. From the early 20th century, the country was able to import large quantities of cocoa from its African colony, the Belgian Congo. Contrary to popular opinion, however, Belgium's colonies did not play an important role in the foundation of the Belgian chocolate industry. By 1900, chocolate was increasingly affordable for the Belgian working class. According to one study, Belgium first started to export more chocolate than it imported in the 1960s, with exports of Belgian chocolates growing exponentially since 1980. Praline is an invention of the Belgian chocolate industry, as is balaton, a kind of packaging associated with high-quality chocolate. Topic: <laughs> Production and standards. The composition of Belgian chocolate has been regulated by law since 1894 when, in order to prevent adulteration of the chocolate with low-quality fats from other sources, a minimum level of 35% pure cocoa was imposed. Attempts to introduce industry standardization have met with little success. An attempt by the European Economic Community EEC to introducing minimum standards of the amount of cocoa butter substitutes across Europe led to prolonged negotiation but the legislation finally enacted, in 2003, was viewed as excessively lenient in Belgium. In 2007, a voluntary quality standard to which about 90% of the country's chocolate makers adhere was introduced by the European Union which set certain criteria for a product to be considered Belgian chocolate. Under this. Belgian chocolate code. Refining, mixing and conking must be done inside Belgium. Many firms produce chocolates by hand, which is laborious and explains the prevalence of small, independent chocolate outlets, which are popular with tourists. Famous chocolate companies strictly follow traditional and sometimes secret recipes for their products. Topic: <laughs> Varieties. <laughs> Topic. Pralines Pralines made in Belgium are usually soft-centered confections with a chocolate casing. They are distinct from the nut and sugar sweets popular in France and the United States which are sometimes known by the same name. They were first introduced by Jean Newhouse II in 1912. There have always been many forms and shapes, nearly always containing a chocolate shell with a softer filling. Confusion can arise over the use of the word praline in Belgium as it may refer to filled chocolates in general or sometimes to traditional praline. Filled chocolates popular in Europe praline refers to caramelized hazelnuts or almonds ground into a paste. Belgian pralines are not limited to the traditional praline filling and often include nuts, marzipan, salted caramel, coffee, liquors, cream liqueur, cherry or a chocolate blend that contrasts with the outer shell. They are often sold in stylized boxes in the form of a gift box. The largest manufacturers are Newhouse, Godiva, Leonidas, and Gillian. Truffles 
most commonly in the form of a flaky or smooth chocolate ball or traditionally a truffle shaped lump. Belgian chocolate truffles are sometimes in encrusted form containing wafers or coated in a high quality cocoa powder. They contain a soft ganache which is traditionally a semi-emulsion of liquid and therefore has a couple of days shelf life at low temperatures and or requires refrigeration. Special truffles sometimes have a fruit, nut or coffee ganache. Rarely they feature a fruit-based liqueur or cream liqueur but remain distinguishable from pralines by their shape and texture in most cases. Crossover praline truffles also exist. Topic Eggs, animals and figurines Hand-finished and luxury examples of eggs, animals, figurines and Valentine's Day hearts are made by many smaller Belgian chocolatiers, as elsewhere, accounting for a relatively small market share however in peak demand at Valentine's Day, Easter, Sinterklaas and Christmas. Economics. Chocolate plays an important part in the Belgian economy, and there are over 2,000 chocolatiers in the country, both small and large. Today, chocolate is very popular in Belgium, with 172,000 tons produced each year, and widely exported. Côte d'Or is probably the largest commercial brand, with their products available in virtually every grocery store in the country. The largest manufacturers of wider varieties of chocolates are mentioned at Pralines. Belgian pralines fondants shaped like seashells, fish, diamonds and individualist creations topped with are sold in town centre shops, market stands and many village shops across Belgium. <inaudible> <inaudible> Belgian brands and chocolatiers Belkelade The Belgian Benoit Nihant Bouchard Brewer Café Tasse Calabout Charlemagne Cornet Port Royal Côte d'Or Dandoy Dascalides Jean-Philippe Darcy De Bile De Freudmont Dolphin Duval Goller General Chocolate Gerbeau Godiva Grand Place Gillian Hamlet Jacques Quata Leonidas Pierre Marcolini Mary Maurice Mong Ku Mong Ku Newhaus Nutri Olivier Molitor Planet Chocolat Beliche Gourmet Victoria Rancock Wittamer Zabar See also Beer in Belgium Belgian cuisine Choco Story, a museum in Bruges dedicated to chocolate Swiss chocolate